this video we'll see how to edit uh, assemblies and sub assemblies for this lane i want to change uh, its width to 3.5 i can change that in in the properties palette over here i can go to width and change it to 3.5 or else i can also go to assembly properties go to construction and and go to the right lane super elevation aor i can change this parameter from here you can put it to 3.5 so you can either do it from here or from or from assembly properties i apply and i click on ok so once i'm okay with that i now want to replicate whatever we've done this is a crowned road and therefore it is crowned here and uh it's crowned here at the top and whatever we have on the right is also what is going to be on the left i want to mirror that on the left and therefore i, I select all these um, sub assemblies through creating uh, through i select the sub assemblies on the right and then up here at the contextual tab there's a mirror command modify sub assembly panel there's a mirror command just click on the mirror command and i am prompted to select marker point with with assembly for the mirrored assembly and just click on this line and whatever is on the right is mirrored on the left <coughs> okay something else that we can edit is the assembly style if i select on the assembly style um, on the assembly i mean here at the contextual tab of the assembly i can go to assembly properties and here you see the basic style we can create a style of our own by co copying the current and calling it rd dash one and then we can change the markers if you want to i just want to change the display so for the baseline that vertical line we can change it to another color for example i can put a green the baseline point I can change it to cyan change everything to green everything else to green and then i apply we apply this and as you can see our baseline has changed it has changed to a green color in the next video we'll cover how to change the code says style, the appearance of the sub-assemblies.